Hello everybody and welcome to runout.tv It's Mal here and we're back playing the golf club today at the Homestead Now I'm not even going to try and pronounce the design of this course but it is going to be in the description a very long designer name go and check him out for his stuff um, we are uh, trying out the camera here so it's on my desk so please forgive me if it seems like it's somewhat in the way I might try a few different positions about where it's best to, to be sat um, okay so this is a medium difficulty course and I'm wondering if I think I probably need to take a club off here oops not a putter and 8 wind Now what I will say guys is that I have been playing golf in real life and I'm not uh, I'm not what you call a golfer. I have a swing that a professional would probably harm himself over. Uh, but I, I do enjoy the game. So 55 with a with a headwind. I might just try and add 10% to this. Uh, that's probably about right. And then just go over a nice lie. Nice hundred percenter. See if this can get close. St sit, sit, sit. Ooh. So um, the the top scores on this. Um, now, medium pace. That might be a bit more, you know. Ooh, just lost it a bit. Stop! Come on. Damn it, I didn't expect it to go that far. This one's back up the hill. Drop. Ah, three putt at the first hole. Putting's my weak point in this game. If you can't put on this game, you're really going to struggle. Um, damn. This is a medium difficulty course, so I'll probably get found out on this. A um, few people have commented on how on how well I seem to play, but I, I think it's because you've only ever seen me playing easy courses, which you know you should get a good score on. Now that's gone really much further than I expected. I'm nearly out of bounds, actually. Uh, 200 yards downhill. 63 to 91, wow. So I must hit this. Perfectly. Well, this hole has gone a little bit wrong here. Try a different shot out. Thirty five yard flop. Try and add some percentage. Haven't started well here. Oh my goodness. Crikey, get over there. That wasn't good. Another drop shot guys. So it's not a long course but it's an awkward course. So what we need to start doing is hitting the fairways first and foremost. That's important. If we're in the rough you're just losing a, an opportunity straight away to, to have a good shot. Now that's, this is okay. It gives us a fighting chance of 290 off to you know partially chip in. 120 with a Cross wind, so if we take a ten percent off, it would be slightly more. Nice contact. This one could be good. Could be good. One. Ah, oh, I didn't want to check. Whoa, whoa, sit. Oh, come on, sit. Eventually, sat. Oh my god. Now 
Not a bad effort, I guess. So we get a pass if we stop the rot slightly. We have a 226 yard par 3. That doesn't look like a par 3 to me, that's going to be down a hole. This is going to be alright, you know. Oh, it bounced the wrong way. Now I thought I might have overdone that and in fact I hit it well short. We gain a par out which is good. I'll take that all day. So what have we got here? We've got a five, right? Okay, well that looks like a fairly standard. Can I steal a bit more yardage here? I leave myself a shootable. Got some nicely into it. I want to leave myself a, a decent chance of sort of scooting towards the hole. We've done that, I think, with a with a nice. Well, didn't factor in the water though. Down there, as you can see, beautiful design there, and we. Oof, gonna have to go over here, I think. Minus sixteen. Wind against. 95 yards, luckily the wind's going to save us, I think. We can chip in. That's actually a lot better than what I thought because I actually played for getting on the green there. So we should be able to flop it almost well. This will be close to the... This will actually be close to the green. The pin's very close. Well, oh no, I didn't expect that. 26 yards. Much expected to be far, far closer. Up eight, forty-two. Oh, that would be me. I think my longest ever puts thirty-three. That's a beautiful shot, just nicely in that gap, almost, you couldn't have picked it up and placed it better. 101 yards, looks spot on. And sit, and sit, oh god, that's perfect. Oof. Get in there. So we get a we get our first birdie of the round, which is quite nice to see. And we've now got a 122 yard uh, chip down a level. So mm, dare I a little bit more maybe? I just wonder if this might not just if it goes in the bunker, I'll be quite upset about this. Well, you can't be upset with that. Get in there. And there goes the club up in the air, celebrating two birdies, so we're back to even. The slow start, 
we've got rid of. Now we've got a par five, so maybe we can. Well, we've gone into that little bank, which is really irritating. Two seven nine, so two eight six down eleven. So we just want to go that way. So we're expecting it to be quite close. Again, we should be able to chip on for under a hundred yards. Oh, that I didn't want that. Oh dear, that wasn't good. That just makes the working out. Fifty five yards, fifty six, eighty two percent. So I want to just add a touch more and get a nice get a nice close shot here gain short get a bit of a roll helped out by the gradient go on get up there oh yes 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 putting well today putting well today Four birds in a row and I've got a handicap on this hole as well so I think I'm not quite sure how this works but I think it means my first shot's technically for free now when you go to the right slightly that means you oh that's not good oh second cut as well you idiot oh dear dear That's a shame. Horrible, horrible tee shot. 78 yards, 75 plus 14. So we need a bit more on there, not that much. Uh, maybe slightly more because we've been been going short. And let's see if we can get, we're going for right close to the pin here. And reverse. Yeah, we didn't get it. So we're just at the apex of the shadow and this is a par put for 19 feet go on, drop, drop your beauty Ooh. we drop a shot I feel like I got hard done by there, I feel like I really got robbed a little bit there so we take a, we go up to 36 um, So this one we're going up a, quite a significant hill here. Can't believe I found the beach. You son of a beach. That'll take. Right, let's get some birds on the board here. Now I'm going to draw this into the wind. Um, I think I've hoofed that into the sand because I didn't negate the... Ah, you dirty devil straight into the beach. No way. Now, oh my god, 98 yards. Sit, sit. Oh dear, <laughs> it's gone all wrong. Twenty nine yards. 
perfect floatable effort. The flop shot is your friend in the golf club, guys. You've got to remember that. So let's get a birdie on this 556 yarder. So we're just off the edge of the green here and we might well be within, well, that's perfect. So we might be able to get this very, very close indeed. So we should get a birdie here, guys. Just nice and steady. Firmly in the hole, get in. So 155, the first thing we do is negate for the wind. I would say that's uh, pretty much nailed on, that might not be enough there, I'm going to go there. Because this is going to be going very high off the tee. 94% power is no good. Yeah, paid for that one. Oof, dear. That's a good shot, happy with that. Yes. So 471 par 4. Again we should get within chippable range for this. This could be close. Needs to sit. Yeah, it's gonna roll. It's probably gonna be chipping on. Well, actually, it's not. So, yeah, interesting. Big. Thirty-four feet. Well, very nearly nailed it. So I was happy with that putt. My putting's coming on a, a bit. Um, I'm not making a... I feel more in control of what's going on on the putting green a little bit more. Right, come on. Where are we at now? We're going to make a decision. Go around there, I think. I think I've turned that into sand. Oh, no. Right behind that tree. Oh dear. So I drew round the tree there. That won't allow the wind to do the work. This might be good. If I, if I have a birdie shot here, I should have probably had an eagle chance, but. 17 feet level. It's close. Oh no! Oh. Bummer.
190 minus 11 left 7 93 ah uh, poo poo well short get in that bunker son get in there get in there you little sod ugh yuck 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 flop shot I'll take that out the sand to be honest Take a paw, knee bother. So we haven't dropped a shot, touch wood. Um, that one turned a bit, didn't expect that. So that's going to be, have I found another one? And I've second cut it again. This is pretty poor. 79 feet, 81, 85. That's more like it. I might even need a bit more than that to be honest. So big, big last shot. This might be very good. Oh, just scooted past it, and it's unfortunate that it was right at the hole. And it's probably the worst put of the day for us. Come on, we have to pull something out of the bag here. Go on, go on, go on, get in there. Right guys, so we got with our handicap a minus two score. Um, as you can see, the drop shots were all in the opening nine holes, front nine, but did a better back nine, came back in and minus one. So decent, but not fantastic. Let's have a look and see what that means in terms of our handicap, 0.2, an improvement. <laughs> so getting better slightly and uh, that's it. So thank you for watching. See you next time.